I got stuck in the rain. <laughs> Heroes at work. Actually, I gotta say, I'm really proud of uh, this place. We have managed to keep COVID out. We got tested for the second time yesterday. That's exciting. Uh, God willing, we test positively negative, as the president says. <laughs> Just wanna take you around a little bit. It's raining, but nothing prettier. Oh, I got work to do. There's a hawk. You hear it? Although I love my little birds. But they're a dime a dozen. I can find that hawk. <laughs> Sorry. Huh? Yeah, it is. Loving this. <laughs> a suspicious white van with a suspicious man in it. Sitting at a retirement community, assisted living facility. When he sees me with my camera, he gets out of his van and tries to talk to me. Um, <laughs> I don't call the police unless, well, I just don't call them <laughs> unless I, well, anyway, I won't call the police unless I, no, I just won't call the police. I can't call the police, so they have killed too many people accidentally <laughs> and I have a big mouth sometimes and I'm afraid I might say something you know <laughs> that will probably get me shot so I'm just gonna keep my mouth shut and not talk to police <laughs> it's probably my best best idea but I highly recommend anytime you come in contact with police that you record them every time because you never know you just don't you never know. Huh? It's not just black people, it's every race. They're killing every race. They're not just killing black people. Uh, I saw a video just, I saw several videos with uh, multi-races and it's not just, they've been killing Americans for years and years and years. It's, since 9-11 it's gotten worse. Uh, so since 9-11 it's gotten much worse um, everybody signed up to be able to 
beat terrorists, but when they're here as cops to protect our nation, except they all forgot about the, you know, Declaration of Independence, you know, our Constitution, our rights. They seem to have forgot about all our rights, you know, right to free travel, right to free speech, <laughs> right to bear arms. I mean, people are getting attacked for just holding cameras. I saw a guy that was the most polite person I've ever seen. He had the most soft-spoken voice. And the whole video, he was talking, holding his camera really far. I mean, he wasn't even saying anything. He was holding his camera, and he was really far away from the police. And, um... Anyway, he's 